Oh, it was solid. You know, I think uh, anytime you're down a few bodies, you, you know, it's a concern. But, uh, you know, we knew what we were about to face. This team, they play hard. And it's not a, a team that, uh, you know, you, you think about playing a record. That's when the, you get set up. You, know, put, you put yourself in position to, you know, lose, lose a game. And I thought you know, our overall approach was great, you know, aside for that stretch late in the fourth. Um, you know, we're, we're, you're fighting human, human nature. Get comfortable, take your foot off the gas a bit. Uh, but overall, I was pleased. Yeah, he had a pretty good rhythm. Um, and I think pick and roll is his, you know, that's his go-to. So we were able to find uh, find him in those actions, and he's able to get downhill, create for himself and others. Now we're easing him back in. There's really no restriction, but, you know, he hasn't really done a whole lot of 5-on-5. We haven't practiced a ton. Just, you know, the density of the schedule um, hasn't allowed for it. So um, we have to be cautious with him, but there are no, like, medical restrictions right now. What were you looking for? Uh, just just that. I mean, I wanted to see him out there, <laughs> see how he would respond. Um, you know, his energy, his ball movement, um, those are things you can't measure, but they, they're impactful. Yeah, he's a spark plug. You know, it's uh, there's so many names you could give it, but his energy is just uh, phenomenal. It's a different different pace, different uh, aggression level, his voice, you know, all those things. You know, and it's second possessions, it's rim runs, it's, it's blocking shots. Um, you know, it's, it's first the floor, his activity is just, uh, it's amazing and it's every day. So it, it really is a, a welcome thing to have. Uh, I mean, I'd rather be where we are than not, but, uh, <laughs> uh, but I mean, you just have to fight that, that temptation to get complacent. You know, I think it, it hasn't come easy, but, uh, and I'll give our guys credit. We've, we found ways on certain nights to just, you know, eke out a win. Um, but. You know, we can't sit here and say, hey, we're good. We have to continue to work every day and get better. Uh, you know, try to minimize some slippage, you know, add some things as we go, hopefully get healthy, get guys back. And in doing that, it, you know, it may take a little bit to get reacclimated. But uh, it's the nature of the league. So when that time comes, we'll, we'll figure it out and we'll find ways to get guys back in. Uh, I mean, his, his rebounding has continued, his, his activity defensively, um, I think has been great. Um, and he, I think he's also kind of using his voice to help uh, that, that veteran presence. Um, he's one of those guys, him, Pope, you know, Trez. They played in big minutes, big moments in playoff games. So it, it's good to have another guy who can kind of just steady the ship. You know, sometimes we get uh, um, a little scattered and he can kind of help bring us back uh, to where we need to be. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, several guys do. I think it's great. It's uh you know, I talked to Denny early, and I said, you got to find yourself a good vet. And thankfully, we have quite a few of them um, and guys who are going to go out of their way to help him, uh, kind of show him the ropes, slow him down a little bit, build him up, give him confidence. And I think that's it's, it's shown in the way he's played, the way he's responded. Uh, so I think it's great. Well, it was just the uh, ball movement. I thought we were just kind of lack of days you know, early in the start and just wanted to get that point across that, you know, let's not uh, – you know, fall into that trap of just playing one on one, and uh, let's get the ball moving. Let's let's play with a little bit more pace. Uh, make sure we're setting screens. We're, we're in our spots early because uh, they're a physical defensive team. They're very active, and I give uh, Jamal a lot of credit. His staff, they've done a great job with this group. You know, and I know they got a lot, a lot of young pieces, and those pieces are going to get better. But uh, the one constant is they play hard, and they're going to play to the wire. So it's it's not a surprise that this team's the number one fourth quarter scoring team in the league. They're going to continue to play. And, you know, tonight, obviously, scored 33 in the, in the fourth, I think, shot just under 50. So uh, they're going to keep coming. And I just didn't like the start and where we were, and I, I wanted to kind of get that point across. I don't think so. Um, you know, it's just it's a long season. You know, there's ebbs and flows to the game. There's ebbs and flows, you know, to each player. I don't know too many players who play at a certain level consistently for 82 games. Um but he's doing some good things, you know, and he, he's trying, you know, with fouls or not. I mean, I, I, like, I love the fact that he's not giving easy, uncontested layups. Uh, well, overall, I think once we got, uh, you know, our defense settled, the transition was an issue. Some of that early in the, in the uh, first half was turnovers. And now you're on your heels. So it's just tough to, you know, anchor your defense. But once we got, once we got uh, our defense set, guys are in the right spots. I thought we were pretty good. You know, uh, we were communicating pretty well. Uh, we were kind of getting through screens and guys were, um, you know, fighting to get back in front, making it, make it trying to make it tough. Um, mm -hmm. Overall, you know, it, it wasn't perfect, never is, but I thought we did a decent job.